Hello everybody. Um, it's 8 o'clock. Thanksgiving Day. My family's outside. Causing a ruckus as usual. Mm -hmm. Um, I want to make a quick video. Not so much about the weight loss surgery as a few people have already um, done videos about other things. Um, this is a holiday that you tend to forget the, the, the core value of the holiday. It is a holiday to give thanks. And I think a big thing that it has turned into is just a holiday of eating and enjoying the food and and it's really not um it is a holiday to to be thankful for what you have and and to be thankful for what you've been given in life not just things but you know family and and love and all that kind of stuff so so I think a big thing with weight loss surgery patients is that they learn that the holidays and going out and being social doesn't always have to revolve around food and and that's actually a big discussion I've had with a few other people throughout the days was just about um, how to socialize without revolving around food. Um, and why it's coming up now is because holidays are a big, that's, that's the big thing because, you know, Christmas, it's about the cookies and the cakes and, you know, and Thanksgiving is a huge holiday where it revolves around food, so, yeah, turkey's good and stuffing and flaw is all good, but it's the important things, either your family and your friends and your life, your children if you have any, your your husband, your boyfriend, your your dog. So um I basically I haven't really discussed what I'm thankful for today, not even to my mom, not to anybody really, because it's hard for me. It's really, really hard. I mean I'm thankful for the the, the obvious things, you know, good health, my family, my nephew, he's He's a huge thing in my life, but thus far I haven't I haven't really lived and to the extent that I want to. Um I can't say I'm thankful for the kid the kids that I have because I don't have any yet. I can't say I'm thankful for a husband or a boyfriend because I don't have one. So yeah, it was a really good holiday. I got to spend time with my family, and we didn't argue, and we didn't, you know, we didn't fight, but I want to, this, this holiday just made me really think about what I want, and that's to start living, so if this is going to wake me up to anything it's that I want it's that I want to start a little to live for me and stop hiding behind this. Stop making excuses for something I don't have because ultimately I'm in control. So, good holiday overall. <laughs> Despite this, I'm really happy for the family that I have because they are wonderful. I'm happy for my friends that I have because they irreplaceable but I do want so much more than what I have I want to expand all hope 
of anything. I want to want. I don't want to be complacent anymore. I don't want to. I don't want to depend on ordinary. You know. So. I hope everybody had a wonderful holiday with their families and their friends, and I hope everybody got exactly what they hoped for out of the holiday. And I'll see you guys when I have more information. Which is not much lately. <laughs> All I know is that the surgery is still set for January 3rd at UC Davis Medical Center. Um, I don't know. I have a pre-op appointment on the 28th or 29th. Is that Wednesday of December? Um, it's a six-hour appointment. Six hours. Yeah. Anyways. Ugh. Did I mention that this is my last eating holiday? Technically. Because I think I'll be on a liquid diet on Christmas. Yeah. I don't feel very good. My stomach hurts and... I feel kind of nauseous because of the sweets. Uh I've been on a really good diet for the past, like, two months, and this is the worst I've felt because I've been on such a good diet. This is the worst I've felt in my whole life, eating, because of the fact that, um, I've been pretty much stuck with just, like, proteins, low sugar, low fat, but now I just put, like, tons of sugar, tons of fat, tons of carbs, tons of everything in my body, and it's just, like not liking me, so I have a headache. I'm tired. I don't know if anybody believes in that trip to van thing, but I'm really, really tired after that. Maybe just because it was just a very, really hearty meal to eat, so. Um, this is my official sign-off because I'm almost at eight minutes. Uh, that's my bedroom. Oh, <laughs> Anyway, I'll see you guys again when I said when I have more information. Bye.